Ladies, gents, and teddy bears, back, back in action. Da -da 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 -da. Ted Connigsby channel back. A little visit day out quickly to RAF Milden Hall. We just uh, caught the 12 F-16s from Spang Darlam Air Base. Oh yeah, Ted Connigsby channel back live here at RAF Lake and Eve, and back to. Con Continue our full show. Yeah, that's right, ladies, shunts, and teddy bears. How are we all doing? Hope you're feeling good. And uh, we were just about to leave uh, Mildon Hall until we seen, well, guess what we've seen? That's right, a huge C5 Galaxy. Thanks a lot, Spanner Flight. How are we doing? And we managed to get that. Thought I'd do the, make that into a uh, fun little video. And uh, there was uh, a few issues with uh, one of the KC 135s. We thought they were going to divert. Right, ladies, shins, and teddy bears. I am back with you. How are we doing? How are we feeling? How are we good? We good? We all right? It's uh, Ted Tuesday, but not not at Coningsby today. So we're, we're here at RAF Lake and Neve. How are we all doing? I'll just get our squadron leader here for those that have just joined us. Thank you. And do you know what? Part two really gives you a chance to hit the like again. And of course, uh, welcome all the viewers. So yes, I have successfully got the footage of the F-16s that came um, as part of Cobra Warrior. Do believe there are more coming tomorrow. Just want to say a big thank you to Richard and his son uh, for taking uh, myself like a personal and, and Ted to chauffeur all the way to Milton Horn back again. So big shout out to Posh Officer Richard. That's right, he's a Posh Officer of the Posh Officers Club of the Ted Coningsby Squadron. How awesome is that? For those that are just tuned in, tuned in and not knowing what's going on, uh, this is the Ted Coningsby channel. My name's Nikos, I'm your commentator and cameraman. This is our very own squadron leader, Ted Coningsby. He lives at 29 at Coningsby, and we're on a uh, day out here for another successful live stream here at RAF Lake and Neve. Now, it is a United States Air Force in Europe base, the 48 Fighter Wing, which consists of four, that's right, four combat-ready squadrons. Beautiful F-15E Strike Eagles here, and of course, F-35As. The sound you can hear in the background are running engines of F-35, so they'll be coming out. Literally just got here, so I can't tell any call signs on what squadrons are running them, but what I can tell you, the squadrons the, that fly the F-35As are the 493rd Fighter Squadron, known as the Grim Reapers. And uh, we've also got the 495th Fighter Squadron, the Valkyries. That's right, till Valhalla, that's the one. All is good. So we'll find out all the details. The two squadrons that fly the F-15E Strike Eagles are the 492nd, which we caught on part one of the stream today before we made over for a little uh, trip over mailed and all. And uh, yeah, so the 492nd, that's the bowlers. Guns up, bowlers. Hope you're all well and good. And uh, they're the uh, bowlers, of, as we said. They're, that's a geographical nickname. They are officially called the Mad Hatters, which suits us down to the ground. <laughs> and they are bleed blue and guns up. And we've also got the 494th Fighter Squadron that fly the F-15E Strike Eagles as well. They are bleed red. That's right, they're the Panthers. And uh, hopefully we'll be seeing them as well. So, brilliant. We didn't really miss a lot when we left. So, of course, the landings from the F... Uh, from the F-15s of the uh, 492nd. So, without further ado, let's just turn this round and see what's gonna happen today. That is the sound 
of F35As, ladies, gents, and teddy bears. This gives you a chance to hit the like again. Oh yeah. Just bear with me a moment. I'm just gonna do a little adjustment on the tripod. If I may. Doing, ladies, shunts of teddy bears. I'll catch up with you very shortly. Grab my comms. Uh, Maybe I have missed a couple of things, not sure yet. Let's find out. Let's tune in. Right, I'm on comms. Here we go. Special thanks to Richard Brown for being the TCS chauffeur <laughs> today. So, uh, I mean, he's pleasure. had the pleasure of having Ted in a Fiat 500. A proper Italian job. <laughs> oh, it was brilliant. Uh, I've also got a bit of a catch-up guards march as well from the other day. Uh, thanks a lot, Gaza. It was a uh, Harry Walker. Guards march to Harry Walker. It was a, a, a belated guards march. I think it was at the... It could have been yesterday's stream. Belated guards march. Harry Walker. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Here we go. 35's coming out. You right down there? Yeah, you right here? Yeah? yeah, I'm good. Good times. I was stood at the side of the Oh, right, cool. Nice. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> yeah. Sorry? No, I'm here and I'm off to Bournemouth. Yeah. We'll start up to Yeah, possibly the Pampers. I did see there, um, unless we missed the takeoff. Has there been much takeoff since we. No, quiet out. So it was the ones this morning, we yeah. hit this morning. Yeah. They've all come back. Yeah. So, right, so that means the Pampers are coming out as well at some point, which is good. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you.
to see Ted Tuesday with a little bit of a difference uh, F35As here how we all doing how we're feeling thanks everyone for uh, for this morning uh, we made that decision to go and um, see the F16s we've got footage for you we'll put it on tonight oh yeah what a buzz what a week already Ted Collinsby channel headed for 28,000 subscribers Woo! what a year Margot Bex pending Guards March for both of you just uh, as soon as we got these takeoffs. Sharp work, get Ted on the scene. Ted Coningsby Channel has its very own Spanner Flight Squadron and uh, they will look after the chats, keeping it sweet and neat. This is a, a family channel. We are a pure military aviation channel. Whether past or present, we shall keep this channel up for all. It is a family channel. It is for everyone, whether you're a child at three years old or 103 years old. <laughs> you know what I mean? In a child, let it release. Enjoy it, just come and join us. No matter what background, experience, the experience, whatever you got, come along, enjoy. Any questions, feel free. We want you to ask questions if you have them regarding military aviation, go for it. This is what we do, gotta keep it fun. Baxter, how you doing? I will be catching up with your guards' marches, my dear. Thank you very much for Bournemouth. Rebecca as well, thank you very much. Davey! Josta Leister, how you doing? Living the dream. How's it going? Living the dream. Mark, my man, how's it all going? Selwyn Owen, how's it going? Mr Chicken watching from Germany. Marco from Edinburgh. Rebecca from Wales. We've got Northumberland watching in the house from David. We've got Germany from Mr Chicken, regards to German Army Ted. Alan Q, how's it going? Yes, got him. Egg Custard smashing out the jokes in Jokesville. Margot Baxter for Gaza's ice cream at, at Skeggy. Nice. Officer Viv, how's it going? Super Chat Superstar, thank you very much. Very generous, lovely lady. Thank you, well said. Lancaster Phantom, how's it going? Look at this. Matt Smith, may the weather decline its emotion. Oi, oi, ladies, gents, and teddy bears. Hey, Duff, what's going on? Evolved today. How's it going? Oi, oi, to you. Aviation of 4K, how's it going? Joster Leister, watching from Netherlands. I'm sure Arjen's here, there he is. Arjen, what's going on? Hope you're good. Gaza, oi, oi. Rob Kennard, how's it going? Oi, oi, to you. Lots of catching up, super chats that I will do, and gifting memberships. I will catch up with the guards' marches. Just want to get you as much aircraft beauty as possible. So, Rob Kennan, thank you for gifting five Ted Connorsby memberships. Marco for uh, Gaz's ice cream. <laughs> That's proper good. Andy Williams, the F-35A is just awesome. You've seen how it can fly. How much more do you need to, to understand that the aircraft is good as a minimum? It can certainly fly. It has a very powerful engine. It's stealthy. It's good. It, is, it's, it just flies well. And the pilots and crew that, that keep this flying the way it does, we've got to hang it to. 
And I'm sure you're going to win when uh, when they fly Ted. The Valkyries are potentially going to fly Ted. Uh, this is a possibility. This is the 493rd fighter squadron. The fact that they've come out from this taxi and Via Sierra, so it's potentially the Grim Reapers because the Valkyries tend to come from the other side, from the right. Sammy B, good afternoon to you. Christine Barnes, oi oi. Jack Carroll, how do I know when stuff will be flying? Just turn up, hope for the best. Potluck. Here we go. One way too far. Here we go. Fifth generation stealth multi role fighter. Oh, yeah. This is the A variant. Send it. Come on. £43,000 of frost about to come at you with the F135. Platt and Whitney engine, here we go. variant by the way ladies gents of teddy bears that is um, uh, start again that stands for conventional takeoff and landing so it can take off and land just like an f-16 or a typhoon they, that's the only variant they have here at rf lake and heath there are more f-35s to come out you can hear them running prepare for air hello got a lot of catching up to do if I've missed one then span a flight or anyone just let me know if I've missed a guards march so I did catch up from yesterday now I've got uh, Rebecca one of our span of flight thank you very much for the super chat guards march thank you very much Thank you very much, oi oi Rebecca, and now Margot Baxter. Guards March. I think there was two uh, Super Chats, one for Gazza's 99 ice cream, and then another one for Bournemouth. Here we go, for Bournemouth. 
with F-35 taxiing at the same time. This time I can confirm we do have the Valkyries coming out. That's the 495th Fighter Squadron, who were uh, disbanded here in uh, 1991 and uh, took them 30 years to come back, reactivated as an F-35A squadron. Welcome back. And then Rob Kennard, thank you for the gifting five Ted Connorsby memberships. It's a good day. Thank you very much, Rob Kennard. Guards March, here we go. Uh, who enjoyed yesterday's stream? Who enjoyed the, the complete mix of theme as well and era? Beautiful. Rob Kennard, thank you for that. Thank you very much. And a bear hug. Ted's feeling the love today. Don't forget, let's do it again. Hit the like. The good thing about part two is you get to hit the like again. <laughs> Ted's just showing you where it is. Ted's not telling you, he's ordering you. He's the squadron leader. Thank you very much. Here we go. Welcome all the new members. Welcome. Oi oi from Italy, says Christian456. Oi oi! Mark Pendleton, how's it going? Living the dream. That was Clacton Air Show. I hope it was good. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. Peacock strikes back. A Scottish oi oi. I love that. It's good. Uh, Daniel, Daniel Erif. Hello from Lakeney. Well, hello. Hello. Home from home. How's it going? Strike the light, peep. Sammy B. Nice one. Let's do this. Send it to right. Andy Williams, send it. How's it going? Hey, hey, hope you're all good. Make sure you've hit the like, Lady Shenta Teddy Bear, 681 watching. Thanks to have you back again. We're going to need another 100 to get back what we had this morning. So apologies for splitting it. We weren't sure. You know when you hear times of certain aircraft coming in, even, even, even domestic. And by far, this is not some bust timetable, train timetable, military ops. already oh it's a lovely shot look at that here we go Look at this! Oh, yeah. 
from the EOR.
Lady Shanks and Teddy Bears, who's feeling it? Joe, great proof, Shelley Belly. How's it going? Ian Wright, what's going on? Christine Barnes, how's it all going? Andy Williams, hope you're all good, still enjoying the Infinity Guys. Hit the line, come on, let's try and get. We nearly got. Nearly 1k watching right now. Come on, ladies, Shelly, Teddy Bears, hit the lights. Marking LN, Lima no member. Lima no member. LN for Lake and Eve. The uh, F 16s that arrive from uh, Spangdalem Air Base will have. Ready? SP for Simon Pewey. Hey. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, for Spangdalem. <laughs> I don't know why it just came to me, but it will have the tail marking SP or spanned on the mare base. And they are still United States Air Force in Europe, hence the letter E at the end. Um, they're from the uh, spanned on the mare base. And like I said, they'll have the tail code SP. Sierra Pup.
Oscar. Come on. Afternoon, Jamie. How's it going?
these are the 494 fighter squadron the Panthers bleed red
four. Still got more F35s coming out. Still got F15s here as well. James Adams down there, Ted, oi oi! Shout out to James Adams! Oi oi! You're not on the screen, but you know. It's fine. It's fine, Probably just uh, <laughs> You can be on the screen with your permission, totally up to you. I don't mind, I don't mind. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. You want to be in it? Yeah. All right. Da -da. Ted, who we got down here? We got James Adams down here, oi oi! Oi oi! How you doing, everybody? You good? All good. Enjoying it? Yes, definitely. Good. Aye, aye. <laughs> nice one. We have hit 1.3k viewers. Come on, let's get more. <laughs> Happy days. There we go. Bring in the life, bring in the fun. Let's do this. Come on.
didn't look good, did it?
uh, probably the best of Lois Quick Climb front ever. You took the cut the days to get over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was at East Kirkby yesterday, a nice mellow pace. Nice it was brilliant yesterday, really good. I really enjoyed East Kirkby. Really. I was talking about that this morning, it's been worth Yeah, that's right, about 10 minutes. I'm sure we raised quite a bit of money if you want to put it in. CJC Wood 81. Thank you very much for your kind words. Tress Buyer, how you doing? Pratt and Whitney F135. Oh yeah. Tress Buyer brings back memories, these, right? Look at these. Oh yeah. Whoa, oh, it might be the F15 now, a problem maybe? Is it? We're at F35, so F35's inbound. Right. Well, what have you got for me, F35? Come on. in the trees there. Here we go, clear to land. But one of the F-35s has requested a low approach, low key. And we're gonna get the Wolfie. Clear to land, here we go. It. Come on. Yes, that's it. Look at that. 
control. than salmon that one beautiful silky smooth right there beautiful meanwhile the show's still not over we've still got aircraft f-15s good doesn't it look at this you should join the show hit the like we haven't done so and i'm not sure what's gonna gonna give you the thumbs up on that let's have a look what we got oh, we hit a fan. come a point where you know I have an overload you've seen that a QCF or but you know what can we just say a massive shout out to Rapcom to tower because they are just phenomenal to, to manage not only here but they manage Mildenhall as well you know to have all these aircraft coming in and out and doing all this and that amazing but you know what I even had the F-35 pilot who requested the very first low key low approach he actually said thank you I've never heard that A17QN, are you doing? Are you good, sir? You're watching from Germany. How's it going? Alex Hilton. Oh, yeah. Noxy Noxy says, brilliant. Ian Wright, nice. Rick, love it. Uh, let's have a look. <laughs> John Minter, I'm really beginning to, uh, I'm really beginning to become a big fan of the F35. <laughs> K Duff, I'm guessing you enjoyed that. Oh yes, this is why this is the only channel for all your live military aviation fixes daily. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> Peter Madlin, how you doing? Darren Parsons, birds and insects, how are you? Doc 
Dr. Soda, how you doing? Chris Brown, how you doing sir? Watching all the way from Cornwall. How is Cornwall? Hope oh, Cornwall's good. It's a bit busy in this car park. Let's get a few car to march as while we can. We've even got Lakey, for those that know Lakey, Lakey is here with us as well, for those that missed the cows at Lakey Wolf. We do have our very own Highland Cow, who's come all the way from Glastonbury. So Chris Brown, Guards March, gifting five Ted Coningsby memberships. Oh yeah! <laughs> Thank you very much for all your support there. It, are there any that I've missed? I probably have I'm amongst all of that. Got a bit hectic. What else have we got here? We got a new member. We got Tone. I remember Tone on there. Tone, welcome to the Ted Coningsby Squadron. Guards March for you. Thank you very much. Uh, we've also got Silver Clouds upgraded to the Porsche Officers Club. Air hell air. Thank you very much for upgrade. Guards March, why not? Not sure if you're going to see Wingy today. He's not really a Jet Noise fan. He's more Merlin fan. Uh, also got Kylo Bear. What a fellow bear, Kylo Bear. Welcome to the Ted Connings with Squadron. Thank you so much. I haven't even spoke about the membership, but thank you for joining us. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Teddy, you're right. Ted, oh no, Ted down, Ted just hit the, the lens. Ted, you're right. There. Sorry, Ted hit the camera and uh, got a bit concussed there. Right, time for some flip! <laughs> that is probably going to end up on a t shirt. Sweep the leg. Here for takeoff, runway 24, push 4, here we go. There it is. So because of the way sound travels, if you look at the engines when it's just about to get really, really small for takeoff, that's what's causing the, uh, the sweeping noise. So it's the actuators on the engines at the back. You'll see them, they go small. But the, the, the sound is delayed by the time it gets here. Watch. You'll see them go small. That's what's making the freak sound. So there'll be a little bit of a delay. Beep. Get ready. Yeah, watch them. Watch the engines go small. the F-15. Oh yeah, zero combat losses. That is a thing. Well, you can't get better than that, can you? Yeah, definitely. I am so going to get a whoop emoji for <laughs> It's got to be done. Whoop the leg. 
It's a bit of Karate Kid there. You alright there? Yeah, good thanks. Good times. But still hear more. More F-35s. I can hear F-35s running. That's an F-35 running. More? Yeah. Why not? Oh, Tent it. Yeah. This is one that's got What else can I hear? Hang on. Definitely F-85. You've got super hearing today, man. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's tuned for the long weekend. I'm sure I can hear an F-35 running. 100%. Yeah, that's a that's F-35. Yeah, definitely F-35. So we'll get more. <laughs> I love that. I need that on a t-shirt. I need it. How do you spell it? Yeah. Uh, FW tweet about three E's and a P. I like that, yeah. Three whip, E's and a P, whip, yeah. Whip. Yep. Definitely. Yeah, it's another one to reflection. Oh, totally. <laughs> Some people spell it with about six E's. Yes, we need a sweep emoji. LEJ Approach, how you doing? Thank you so much for your help. LEJ Approach, behind the scenes, working hard for the TCS. All the way in Germany, thank you very much. I can even hear, F can I hear an F-15? What's this? I can hear an F-15, because it is an F-15 coming. But I can still hear, I can still hear an F-35. That is 100%. More fweepage. Fweepage. Fweepster. Fweeping. Fweep the floor. Fweep the leg. Fweep everything. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm buzzing. You're fweeping. I'm fweeping. Oh, oh, yeah, very good. <laughs> can't, can't say that. Uh, <laughs> no, for the bird, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, the, the noise is generated uh, by the actuators actually moving. So you'll notice the engines just get smaller. The exhaust part of it, the back, it just goes smaller. And that's what causes the sound. But because of the delay of the time it gets here, that's why it, you see the, uh, the back of the engines just shrink and then about two seconds you get the fleet noise. Oh yeah. <laughs> Peter Madeline, I'm good, thanks, enjoying the show. Why not just throw some more F-15E Strike Eagles at us? Even more is another one behind that one. Look at this. Ground crew are big salute to you guys and girls and bears if you have any for uh, for what you do every day, every day. Look at them there now. Look at the ground crew Drews there, just doing their thing. Amazing, keeping these aircraft airworthy. Even behind the scenes. Oh yeah. Take Connie's big channel live here at RAF Lake and Heath. And uh, it's busy. Oh, you way, you right down that? Yeah. Oh, you way. It's all good. Right there and all. Yeah, 
Yeah, not good is it, Sammy? We need a few more likes. Come on! Like 1.3k watching and only 700 likes. What's going on there? Oh my god, there's more! If you're watching there's it on more. a big screen, then grab your device. Some smart TVs will allow you to hit the like. Grab your device, hit the like, support the tech on the channel. Oh yeah. And it's free to subscribe and hit the like. I mean, can't get better than free. Mark's just adding another like. I'm sure I heard an F35. Oh well, I'll take six F15s instead. <laughs> tail flash indicating it's the 490 second fighter squadron the bonus right lady sheds teddy bear squadron leader ted coningsby ordering everyone to hit that like button come on thumbs up and don't forget you can subscribe well actually no what do you mean you can you're ordered to subscribe come and join us on this wonderful military aviation channel and of course, if you are already subscribed, don't forget, hit the notification bell button. You'll be notified of our latest and greatest live streams and videos. You'll enjoy the show. So you get the sweeping noise as well from the uh, F-16s. You can get them on there as well. And the way the hydraulics work on the nozzles, the actuator, the hydraulics make that loud pitch, satisfying sweeping noise from its hydraulics. And we'll get to see them in action again very shortly as these F-15s depart. Nice one, man. See you soon. Watching from. 
from Fort Worth. CJ Seabrook, 81, nice one. Regards to you from Texas, oh yeah. Nice one, Trespire, I knew you'd be in today, checking in. Thank you very much. Trespire, great videography. Thank you so much, Trespire. Watching from Israel, hope you're well. Regards to you and whoever you're with watching. Uh, CJC Woot, how you doing, man? So yeah, just a reminder, this is a uh, United States Air Force in Europe base situated in Suffolk near the village of Brandon and of course the other end, the village of Lakeneath. Used to be a Royal Air Force base, oh yeah, before it uh, was taken over by, uh, was used by um, United States Air Force from 1948. Thank you very much. Great channel. Congratulations on your first month with the Ted Coningsby channel. Oh, yeah. What? So, yeah, from Matt. Uh, in 1940, used by the Royal Air Force from 1941 up until 1948. Hence, it's still got the uh, Royal Air Force title. Of course, that's the name of the base. Similar sort of thing, because um, if you look at Aviano or Spang Darlin, they're not Air Force bases, they're Air Base, because uh, they're, not, they're not in their native country, so to speak. So, uh, oh, hey! Hey! Oh, all is good. was the satellite, uses a satellite station and a decoy airfield to, uh, to Milden Hall. First ever bomber, first ever aircraft situated, actually physically used at the base was the uh, short Sterling bomber. Uh, let me guess, oh, I've, got, I've got to remember, 149 squadron? 149 squadron. And of course you had the uh, yep, got it. And then there's uh, several other airfields around here which are no longer in use now. It might be something that we could do for our Lost Airfields episodes. I've got one already on the case. It will surprise you, this new Lost Airfield episode 2 coming up. Um, hopefully I'll get that for you in the next couple of months. It does take time because there's drone work in use and visits and reccees and that kind of thing and get all the information to pass on to you. Got to do a little bit of homework, but you will love this one. Not, it. I found it. I'll be honest with you, I was trying to find a pub, somewhere to eat <laughs> and uh, stumbled across. There we go. <laughs> sure name, I love Stuart. Yeah. Fast 
Frankie, cool man. Salute to your nephew. Just above what a KC135, which originally was going to be in formation, I believe. But uh, sadly, it's. Uh, I don't know for whatever reason they have to quit the formation. Belly 3.5. I've really enjoyed this channel daily since I joined last week. Thank you very much. Thank you so much there, Shelley. Costa Leicester, hope you're good. Short M, how's it going? Aaron Oxford, nice to see you on here. How's it all going? Short M, Claire Bear's here. Claire Bear joining the chat room. Station at Texas at Fort Hood. Nice. Thank you for that. Thank you very much. Nadine Wild, such a good distraction to my back to school planning that I should be doing. <laughs> Where's Amy? Amy, where you been, girl? Where is she? Can't see Amy on here at the moment. Multi hobby man, hello, just got here. Short runway 24, here we go. We're on. <laughs> part of the show now, that, isn't it? It's part of the show.
35. Never mind. Not bad being wrong because there was a lot of F-15s that come out. Happy days. Just look. Oh yeah. Yeah, I told you, one landing, one starting. But are you alright? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, Buddy, we're going to have a walk around to the side, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we catch you, uh, yeah. catch you up? Can we go? Yeah, yeah, we're good. Yeah, I've just got the bungees on. It's all good. Uh, two o'clock. Uh, maybe that, not sure. But it's scattered, so we might have made it. We might have avoided it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Still another two minutes. Right, yes. Yeah. See you in a bit. You alright, yeah? How yeah, you doing? Yeah. Well, I do comment on your stuff. Oh, thank you. When I, when I get a chance, I'm normally driving when you start going live in the oh. week. Yeah, you good, buddy. Yeah. You're good. Yeah, I commented a few times. I've got the same surname as your other half, your better half. Oh, right. Yeah, so you, you might have noticed. I'll oh, finish them. That's it, done. This is just too good. You patch it up now? Too good to um No, no, not at all. Not too good to, to yeah. not do this. Yeah. Just follow the dream and go for it. I've never seen so many planes. Never seen so many planes. First time down here, I was open to catch up with you. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, it's brilliant today. I, mean, I, I went over to Mildenhall to catch the F-16s, but I wasn't too sure on what time they were coming. Um, which had to split the stream into two. Um, I was hoping they'd come before I start streaming, but it doesn't always work out. It's military at the end of the day, so. Yeah. Well, we've come off from uh, Birmingham to Great Yarmouth for the week. Oh, lovely. Uh, one of my plans was to go uh, out. Yeah. Maybe uh, over to Donanook. Donanook? Mm. Nice. Maybe. Mm. Can be good. Off today. Oh, she's working today. Thanks, Chris. How you doing? Nice to meet you, Chris. What's a normal time for a return? About 45 minutes to an hour. over a thousand every time so it should be all good. Yeah, you too, buddy. Oh, thanks. Geez. Thanks for commenting and supporting us. Thank oh, you. Hi, guys. I'm Nikos from the Ted Coningsby crew. Oh, yeah. We want to say a massive thank you to all of our subscribers for getting us to where we are today. We have gone all over the country, as far as Lozzy Mouth and military areas such as air weapons ranges, low flying areas, heritage centres and special flights for Ted too. 
We could not do this without your support and your support will be rewarded. So we have an exclusive membership so that you can join the Ted Coningsby Squadron. We have one level of membership so that every one of you can enjoy it and that no one is left behind. We have exclusive perks for our members too to enjoy, such as members only videos, which include deleted scenes, music videos, behind the scenes footage and more. Members can take part in members only polls. There will also be discounts for our members too on our merchandise. And you'll also get your own emojis and special member badges next to your name too. All you have to do is click the join button and all this for just £1.99 a month. Your membership will help fund our channel to get us around the country. And for this, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone that has joined already. Aww, yeah. Do you remember what's not your first lesson? you remember it? Good, you good, yeah? Yeah. Good time. Thank you very much, as always. Any chance to have a quick photo? Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, good timing, actually, good timing. Yeah, uh, should get up the ladder. Yeah, that's, no, no, it's good time. I was needed to get something. I forgot something down there anyway, but it's always a good time. No, no, I forgot to get the, um, I forgot to get the bungees on here to, get to support the ladder. Yeah, of course it is. Yeah, fine. Not a problem at all. Ain't it? Good idea. Cheers, Lucas. Yeah, well, it was just as well because I went to Mildenhall to go and get the F-16s, came back. Did you? Oh, you? So you got the F-16s as well. Did you stay for the C-5? The Galaxy? No, no, we watched the first four and then we started heading back and someone mentioned that it was going to be an hour before the next battle four. Yeah, that's right. No worries. How you doing, ladies? Shouts to Teddy Bears. Right, we've got some uh, inbound off. Uh, here we go. Thanks, Craig. Just seen your message on my watch. I was like, aha.
Beautiful. Here we go. Right. We'll get on comms quickly. I just had to get a couple of bits and pieces from the van. Hope we're all good. Hope we're good. Hope we're all feeling well. How are we all doing? I was 16, I was a sick. Oh, did you catch it? Did you catch it, Justin? No, I didn't catch it. Did you see that I did? Why am I still in the future? Right, Lady Shunt's teddy bears will be with you very shortly. Where's that Yes, Jamie, how you doing, man? Alright. Yeah, you good? Yeah, you've been down a million Have you? Yeah, I was there in the morning. Yeah. And the C5. Yeah, I got that. I, um, yeah, that was, that was something else. <laughs> to see that. I was right at the approach for them. That was pretty good. Yeah, you just got here. I've been here all day. Okay. Oh, what, were you here and then went and come back? Yeah, I've been everywhere. Good times. That's the way to do it. That is the way to do it. I'll just catch up with everyone, see how they're all doing. Sugar will start becoming back in dribs and drabs. Usually about an hour to an hour and a half, depending on what they're doing. Yeah, it's quite a better. This, I know. Uh, I remember when we started doing our lives down in the field. We had uh, our very own. I know many of you miss the cows at Lake and Heath. This is Lakey. She's uh, a bit of a celebrity here on the show. Does get a bit confused while she's doing here, not in the field, but she just likes to just appear there and just have a look around. Beautiful, nice one, Lakey. Right, and then I'll just catch up. Just a few shout outs if we've got some look, some look, we got any, and we all do it. Thanks a lot, Craig, for that. Nice one. Oi, oi! Erin Wilson Nikos, the live stream you did the other day, a day ago, with the Wacky Wabbit, was the day after my dad had a flight in the aircraft. Wow, that's amazing. That's pretty cool. Nice one, Mycroft Holmes, watching from Australia. Big shout out to all the span of flight to keep the stream welcoming and fun. That is how we do it. That's how we do it. Thank you very much. Very well explained about the G yes, yes. and their weight, their trespire. Thank you very much. <laughs> Skim the tree, says Davey. Loving it. Hope you're all enjoying the show so far. So uh, very shortly in dribs and drabs. Should start to see the aircraft uh, coming back. Gary Gold, thank you very much. Welcome to the Ted Coningsby Squadron. Thank you very much for all your support. Very kind of you. We will need to update our video. It's an old one. Now that I've uh, going full time, it'll be good. So uh, thank you very much. Gary Gold, our latest and greatest member. Thank you very much. Get you a guard's march. And, uh, in the distance there, look, look at that guard's march with uh, a KC-135 in the distance. That's pretty good. Yeah, Ted, take it away. Our latest and greatest member. Thank you very much for joining the Ted Coningsby Squadron. Guard's march for you. 
Our latest and greatest member. Thank you very much. Thanks, Ted. Ted, how's it all going? You enjoying it, yeah? That's all good. None. See what else is going to happen throughout the day while we wait for the F-15s and the F-35s to return. Speaking of friendly, don't forget we've got our very own Reggie. Where's Reggie? Who's that? Uh, How's it all going? Eee, <laughs> you're right there now. How we doing here now? Back here on deployment here now. Back to Lake Canif, you know. How's it all going there now? You all good there now? What's going on here? Just making sure there's such a busy car park here now. We need to make sure that everyone's behaving themselves now. Arr! Make sure you hit that like button there now. How are we doing here now? I need to check everything. These cars going past there now. I need to make sure they're all good. Make sure no one's up to any funny business around here. Yes, yeah, so they're all good there now. Behaving themselves there now. That's it. My name's Reggie. That's right, I'm RAF Regiment. I'm out here on deployment. Don't mess around around here now. Looking out for trouble. Anyone up to trouble? Got to take care of it with trouble. What I do there now. That's right. Rough regiment. We don't do any of this flying business. Nah, 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 nah. Down now. We like to keep our feet on the ground there now. Arr! That's how we do it round there. We use planes to jump out of them like the C 130. We used to go flying around there now and I like flying out of them and then giving air, giving codes called JTAC. That's right. We send the coordinates out there now. That's right, you sent coordinates. See that? I've just sent a coordinate to that car alarm. Boom. That's how we do it there now. We're like commandos, us regiment. I know. We got special moves there now. Like forward, back, back, kick. Makes two of us. AOE, alright there now. AOE, alright there now. AOE, alright there now. That's how we do it. One Reggie is like a lot of them. Two. Good there now. I'll do it again. Forward, back, back, kick. You gotta try it there now. Makes two of us pop up. AOE, alright there now. AOE, alright there now. What's going on round here and there now? See that? It's not real. It's just like my commando in me making us appear like we're everywhere there now. It's quite good there now, isn't it? There now. Better behave yourself there now. That's how we do it there now. Ted's um, Reggie showing off his uh, special move forward, back, back, kick. I'm sure many of you remember uh, Mortal Kombat or any of the computer games that used a special. Uh, Uh, Martin Wright, welcome to the TCS Posh Officers Club. Thank you very much for joining. Guards March for you. To a Martin Wright. Thank you very much, Martin. Guards March for you coming up. Our latest and greatest member now of the Ted Coningsby Posh Officers Club. Thank you very much for that. You right there now, Ted. You all good there now. Everything all good under control? That's good there now. We don't want like any trouble going out to our squadron leader, Ted Goddingsby. That's right there now. I've got to do a guard's march here now, so he gets me on orders there now.
Thank you very much there, Ted Darnell. Oh, hope you enjoyed those mass takeoffs just earlier there. It's quite a lot. Anyone count them? Who counted them? What do you reckon? Is there about 20 there? 22? Maybe more? What's going on here? Look at this. Yeah, that's right, we've got a new emoji, it features Reggie. You better believe it. That's how he does it, that's how he says hello. Similar to Oi Oi. He adds a bit of an A in there, and he apparently has different accents to confuse the enemy, he says. Lovely. That's right, Reggie doing a draw under his orders. <laughs> Lacey Wright, how you doing? <laughs> Hope we're all well. Hope uh, you're all enjoying the show so far. Well, we just smashed 27,271 subscribers. Wow, yeah. Come on, another 29 will be on 27.3. Very good. Starting the week as we mean to go on. So this week, unfortunately, there is no live tomorrow because we are en route to Bournemouth, which appears to be a very, very wet one. Um, I think tomorrow is a nice day, so it's a bit of a shame we've got to travel in it. And then the air show on Thursday is how we say on the TCS, it's going to be emotional. Uh, so yeah, and Friday doesn't look too good either, I don't think. Um, or does it? Shall I check? Shall I dare check what Friday holds? the crystal ball that is <laughs> let me check because it doesn't look good well first date horrendous it's just oh dear oh yeah and it's it's been typical for air shows this year pretty much sadly friday looks oh my days friday actually looks all right oh dear oh, yeah friday friday good 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 yeah we'll take friday we'll take friday okay so first day emotional friday good okay we'll take that Santa Teddy Bears, I hope you're all enjoying the show and having a good time. So yeah, uh, let's have a look. So Thursday, Friday, hoping to live stream your Bournemouth Air Festival. Uh, Saturday, we will meet and greet you guys, which will be nice, it'll be a good chance to meet you. We'll let you know where we're gonna be. It'll be an hour before the air show starts, all right? Just to give you a chance so you can at least meet us and then enjoy the air show after. So it'll probably be sort of in the center, roughly around where the center line is. Last year, if I remember, the red there was a red arrow um, on display. There was—I don't think it was a real one, but you know what I mean—the red arrow that you can go in. We'll probably meet somewhere near there. I'll put a little. Um, of course, things could change this year, so I'll, I'll, I'll uh, give you like a little landmark where we can uh, where we can meet and come and see us and say hello. And then, yeah, so Saturday we will depart Bournemouth eventually and head back to Ted HQ and. Uh, and Sunday of course but we will have our regular videos to keep you entertained and then it's time to plan for the next week after that and then the week after that it's a bit of Lake District and then the week after that a bit of RAF Valley Mac Loop and then the two weeks after that it's our road trip all the way to RAF Lossy Mouth like I said earlier you know it's one of those things where the TCS you know relies on your membership uh, so yeah, how we doing ladies, gents and teddy bears? Hope we're all good. Right, how's the hair looking? Look at that. Almost like Moss from the IT crowd. Side part in that. So, ladies, gents and teddy bears. So with the Ted Coningsby membership, it's a really good chance for you to not only be part of the squadron where you do get lots of um, YouTube perks, but it gives you, you know, a chance to be a part of the squadron and help funding it. You know, because at the end of the day, we said that, you know, we go just now, we go to Lossy Mouth, we go to Lake District, Mac Luke, 
those sort of places that they, they can be quite far but this is a regular thing now the Ted Coningsby channel we are a full-time military aviation channel and to be part of the squadron your funds help put towards our, our costs to get out there so fuel isn't cheap as you as you know so but it does allow us to put fuel in our van and get around and with the some of the bases that are quite far at Lossy Mouth and, and you've got Mac Loop, this kind of thing. Sometimes a little cheap and cheerful B&B um, will be used from the funds to just, just get us a little bed there and just sleep and just get up the next morning and continue with the uh, continue with the action. And the TCS, the Ted Coningsby Squadron, does give you a chance to have some wonderful YouTube perks. I mean, you've all heard of Netflix. Well, we got Ted Flicks, ladies, gents and teddy bears. I know, Ted Flicks. Let me just give you an idea. You may have heard on that little video earlier, just um, um, you get lots of YouTube perks. So we'll start off with the fun stuff. Members, if I can ask you to do what you usually do, thank you very much at this point, smashing out those wonderful emotions Emojis. So we got emojis where you can use on the chats, uh, in comments, and anything to do with our YouTube channel, you can actually interact uh, using the um, special TCS emojis. You'll also get a badge next to your name, and it does change colour depending on length of service. Now, I did mention Netflix. Now nah, you don't want that. You want Tedflix. Ladies, gents, teddy bears, for just $1.99, not only can you get the little fun bits with the emoji and the badge next to your name, you get members only videos. That's right, exclusive footage that I make just for you. Um, you get uh, basically deleted scenes, behind the scenes, um, previews of videos that we're going to release to the public, but you get to see them first. Um, Ted cam footage, and of course, Ted likes to star in music videos, don't you, Ted? Ted's an excellent electric guitarist, he really is, and we make uh, music videos as well. You'll also get a uh, discount as well. So thank you very much because you help fund the channel. We give you something back. You will get uh, a discount code where you can use on our online store. Oh yes, tedconningsby.co.uk. Check out the online store. Uh, currently for TCS members, it's 1515% discount. Code will be in your members area and you also get access to a very special server. Now, if you enjoy the chat and the banter that goes on on the chats, you don't have to wait till we're live to start chatting to other fellow TCS members we have our very own discord server where you can come and chat to uh, other TCS members so that is an offline server you can come and join in again the code is released once you become a member and uh, we also start to have our TCS events that's right our very first Ted Coningsby squadron party I believe we've only got 11 tickets left 26th of November and um, this year and um, you get exclusive first dibs into getting tickets. So first of all, tickets will be released to just members. And then when there's a, just a couple of months left, we will release them out to the public. So it gives you a chance to come and join us all under one roof. And if you're feeling posh, you can join the Posh Officers Club run by Wingy. And uh, it you get extra discount. You get 25% discount as well on our online shop currently. And of course, you are posh to say that you give a little bit more to the Ted Coningsby Squadron. So thank you very much. Members, thank you so much for supporting the Ted Coningsby channel. Those that have been gifted Ted Coningsby memberships today, please get it another go. Go in, don't just cancel it straight away. We rely on that to keep us going. Do check it out and just enjoy it. Give it an, another month and I can assure you, you will love it. You will love the members only videos. You, you, you will, you're in for a treat and all of the perks that you get with it. So do check it out. Um, those that have taken out membership today, thank you so much. And like I said, existing members, thank you as well. And those that have gifted Ted Coningsby memberships, thank you so much for doing that for us. Thank you for spreading the word and trying to get everyone on board. It's a world of TCS, and we're here live at RAF Lake and Eve. Oh, yeah. Well, summer's pretty much over at the moment. <laughs> it looks and feels emotional today. Uh, sounds like was that Valkyrie Charlie that's to our right so again if they're using ILS that's the instrument landing system so that would mean they'll just come in straight onto the approach if they're using Charlie it's just to our right if you ever hear that if, obviously if they're using runway 24 they'll come from this direction if they're going to use point Charlie 
just to give you an idea. Uh, if you're on initial, again, Simulate will be right behind us and they'll go right over us here and into the brake. So these are excellent indicators to, uh, to help us uh, sort of get our bearings right to find out where they are. I swear, your hands are so cold. So yeah, remember the uh, ILS, as it's called, the Instrument Landing System. Uh, basically just sends frequencies to the aircraft and, and in basic terms the pilot just matches up those two frequencies so that it's aligned perfectly that's why all aircraft if there's a, if there's a flight of four using the ILS each one of those will be exactly the same landing because they match up those two frequencies uh, to get onto the right glide path and straight onto the correct three degree glide path three degree glide path is a little bit different I hear it's uh, on each each airfield can be different yeah. very slightly. I won't go in too much of the glide slope, but I did oh. say three degree and I don't want to confuse you too much in that. Have a little look, check out the glide slope. They could be going through different runways. Yeah. I will catch up with your uh, guards marches. I've got a hello. Hello. Are you doing all right? Yeah, you good? Yeah, all good, man. So uh, should have some, uh, last time I checked was Charlie, so that's to my right. If those are the ones. first month membership gift thank you very much um, Rob Kennard you're awesome Nikos much love thank you very much Cliff Burrows thank you just got to catch up with you guys as well and get your super chats in with guards marches John Minter money to buy all the bears including Claire Bear a stick of rock from Bournemouth here we go on Charlie here they come oh yeah
Okay. And in south. Have a look now. Let's have a look. So they could have, we could have ended up with them. Oh, wow. right. uh, catch up with your guards marches as well and then wow. <laughs> John Minter, thank you so much uh, for your super chat. If I've missed any, I'm going to try and do a backlog. Apologies there. I've got John Minter, money to buy the <laughs> all the bears, including player bear stick of rock from Bournemouth, Guards March. But John Minter, thank you very much for your super chat. Oh, yeah. And I've got uh, Rob Kennard. You're awesome, Nikos. Much love. Guards March for you. Thank you very much for your super chat. Thanks a lot, Rob. Really appreciate everyone's support today. So much love on the channel. It's amazing. Birds and insects, thank you for your super chat. Guards March and your super sticker. Guards March. Thank you very much. Um, I've got Cliff Burrows first month so fast. Thank you very much. Oi, oi. Cliff Burrows, first month membership, thank you, a gift. Oh, you're so kind, thank you very, very much there, Cliff Burrows. The Guards March for you, and uh, onwards and upwards for the Ted Coningsby channel. Ted's doing the jolly. Thank you very much. Direct Charlie, here we go. Valkyrie one, so to our right, we should have an F-35 right now. Here we go. Oh, we've also got one on an ILS as well. So, yeah, just behind me. ILS as well. Two of them inbound. to land ladies gents and teddy bears yeah that's fine so yeah so we are expecting f-35 here we go see here we go f-35 to my right here we go Absolute beautiful demonstration. An example of tower just running things. Look at this. One on ILS, one on like final. Beautiful. This looks good. Smooth, a little bit of smoked salmon there. And here we go. Two F 
35s. But intentions not known, didn't get to hear what they were going to do, so let's find out. This one will be a mystery. In they come, two F35As, Valkyries. So, no, it's still quite far. It's fine. So they'll be coming in on initial, which is just behind me. Behind me now. Steady Bears Ted Connors B Channel live here at RAF Lake and Eve. How we're feeling, how we're doing on this Ted Tuesday. I've seen two F-35s as well in the distance. In fact, there's a lot of F-35s in the distance. Hang on. Look at this! Mum, there's four F-35s.
I've not even did it on the zoom there. <laughs> Nearly ended up in the aircraft.
Pitch. So 35 versus F15 by the look of it. Let's have a look. So 15 will be landing. Yeah, because they're doing like a six or seven minute thing. Huh? Low approach as well, yeah. yes. Got a low approach as well. It could be from the uh, aircraft just back there. I'm not, I'm not even okay, so this I'm one should be a land. Should be a low approach, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, 
two more low approaches, one each, here we go. Stop. <laughs> it's amazing. I'm never really 
security, but I'm pretty sure they're going to fly into my uh, buggy and put the signs in the back there. Yeah. 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 Um, I'm going to do a Navy chance since any bears up, we're all good. You're welcome. Oh, yeah. Catch up with all of you on the messages. Hope we're all good. Hope you're well. Uh, nice to see Alan Burden here. Davey, how's it going? Margot, how's it going as well? <laughs> I can see some scoring for some landing. Oh, it is good. Nine likes to go. Oh, wow. We just hit 1K likes. Thank you very much, everyone who's done that lovely to have that on board with you two doing that thank you so much awesome another stream i'm not expecting the one this morning to get a thousand likes that was only it was under an hour or whatever it was that's great thanks a lot Arjen. thanks a lot everyone who's uh, supported the channel as per usual and especially today live is live thank you so much Thanks a lot, he's at Ian Wright. Amazing job, Nikos. Uh, B2's over Norway. Thanks for letting us know, uh, Davey. Thanks a lot, Chris Burrows. Awesome camera, fantastic camera work, Nikos. Awesome non stop action. Thank you very much. They can be challenging, especially when they come from everywhere. You have to kind of pick which, which you, you know, which one that you want. Sorry, I keep nudging that over there, don't I? to kind of pick which uh, scene you want to go for with the, the four F-15s and the four F-35s. Well deserved, thank you. Bar thanks very much, Mark Pendleton. Thank you very much. Uh, David Osborne, absolutely. And that, that just shows absolutely amazing skills and airmanship from the... Uh, from Tower, from ATC, to manage all of that. Thanks very much, everyone at Rapcom. And uh, Lake, and Off, Lake and Heath Tower, thank you very much. Hi, Meth, it's been a busy day, you missed it. Um, it, basically from the takeoffs it's been non-stop and then from the arrivals it's been non-stop. Very, very, very good day. Rick A17QN. Not sure if that's such, should I just call you Rick? <laughs> um, always Nikos, thank you. You're welcome, thanks a lot. Thanks, I do appreciate all your comments this is why TCS is the best on YouTube thanks Cliff Burrows thank you very much Hello, you all right there? Good, you good? Yeah, I just came to see Ted. Oh, <laughs> you are not the only one. Never fear, Ted is here. You're not the only one to have that request. I think everything's all coming. There might be one, I'm not sure. It's most likely an F30. Oh, we'll hear it. Anyway, I'm pretty good at jumping up this ladder. I think people have uh, seen that in the real life. I've been curious about how many Curious? Yeah. Ah, right, yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, I'll come and say hello. Oh, 
corner over there. Or something. Yes. yes. So it was one of those do I don't I come here and start the stream until I start at 1 pm. I came here and the basic weather would come first. So I thought no. So I thought, I'll tell you what, start the stream, tell everyone, I can just kind of go to the middle of the room. So that's what I did, start the stream, 56 minutes later, I was like, yeah, bye everyone. Yeah. Cut the stream, we drove down, got the F-16s and a C5, thrown in, and uh, came back in. smoke over there but it seems to have dissipated oh, now. Oh okay. Uh, I've just driven past it. Whether it's not the day before September. They've got, they've got Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's Friday, no, don't oh, okay. I remember that. So they have, they have a bank holiday, they have a US holiday on the Monday, 
Shen to Teddy Bears, I hope you're all good. I hope you've all enjoyed the show. What time is it anyway? We are. Oh, it's coming up to 20 past three. We'll hang around till 1600 and see if there's any more movements. Seems to be another C5 coming into land. Oh, we're bound to see that from here. Yep, it's what, C5 coming into Mildenau. Another one. <laughs> Up with some of your guards marches as well. Um, got quite a few. John Minter, let's have a look. Yeah, got that one. I think I'm up to date. Um, there's another one. Yeah, I think for Ted's Waterproofs. Yes, Margot, thank you very much. I don't think I've read that one out. For Ted's Waterproofs, because well, I think we're going to need them at Bournemouth. Guards March. Thanks, Margot, for the super chat. Another superb day here at RAF Lake and Heath. How are we all doing? How are we feeling? Hope we're all good. Thanks, Margot, because I think we're going to need waterproofs. Here we go. Is that it there? No, nah, it doesn't look like it. No, that's not how it looks. No, that's not C5. No, it looks like a C1 MC1 thing. Right there. Well, that C that C five is going to look like a monster now compared to the yes MC one thirty. If it is an MC one thirty, I'm not too sure if it is an MC one thirty, but uh, I know they have the MC one thirty as a special ops commando two type of type of Hercules. Just realised that is the C-130 that landed today. So apologies, my bad. It's getting late. <laughs> Going, does Reggie put the cat out and lock the gate? <laughs> yeah, I think he does. What else have we got here now? Chops are still out. Fire extinguishers are still up. It's possible it could uh, could get more.
Yeah, I'm Grand Crew Drew, how you doing? Hope you're all good, look at this. Just been doing a bit of work on those stealthy F-35s. That's right, I'm Grand Crew Drew. No, I fix things, that's right. They break it, we fix it. That's what we do. Thanks, Nikos, thanks for taking that patch. How are we all doing? That's right, the Valkyries. A bit of special stuff going on in those aircraft. Can't even reveal some of that info. But I hope you're all good. I'm Grand Crew Drew, that's right. Watch your fella, how you doing? Top geezer, that. Top geezer. All good. Grand Crew Drew it. That's right. They break it. We fix it. That's what we Grand Crew do. A lot of people forget about us, but you know what? It's not the pilots that get that thing up in the air. It's us. That's right. If it's broken, ain't going nowhere. That's right. How are we all doing? Hope you're watching wherever you are around the globe. Whether you're watching on the old dog and bone or the wobbly jelly. Hope you're all enjoying the show. How's it going? Now, where's the current bunk on today? Well, at least it's not more than Mindy. My bonnet looks all right in this, doesn't it? Yeah, that's right. Been quite a busy day around here, isn't it, Nikos? Very good, I love planes. That's right, when I was a nipper, I've always wanted to fix them. That's right. And that could be you one day. It's not always about the pilots, you know? That's right, there's lots of work that you can take part. There's a big career in the Royal Air Force and the United States Air Force. That's right, they're doing exchange as well between RAF and United States Air Force. It's nice, that. Really, really good stuff. You can join us. That's right. You might be really good at fixing things. Doesn't mean you need to fly. It's really important to remember that, because there's lots of career paths in the, in the Air Force. That's right. If you're good at cooking, you know what to do. organising you might want to be working in tower that's right lots of good stuff in there but of course me I'm ground crew I love fixing things now let me tell you something it takes a lot to be ground crew it takes a lot you need a good pair of longers and lingers good plates of meat and you're all ready to go and a little bit of a noodle does help and all sometimes you get parts and you think where does that bit go again you put it all back together and you always got a spare part that's not good so then what we got to do is take it all apart and then put it back together again. I take pride in what I do. Us ground crew, look at us. When we're over there, they're busy putting things together and making sure pulling out bins it's for the safety of the aircraft and the pilot. That's right. Still engines running, so I think I'm wanted. Right, everyone, mine out you go. I'm ground crew, Drew. See you soon. Better go to the sweet shop. I'm going to go and get some of those fruit salads today. And of course, a good old portion of flying sauces. I love them sweets. They're all good. So yeah, I just thought I'd pop round with my BM. That's right, got a BMX. I like cycling to work. I like it. Right, see you later, everyone.
thing. Right, thanks for time for a spot of tiffin before we begin the next wave, I think, at this rate. I'll be back in a moment then, ladies and Teddy Bear's just gonna go and have a little bit of a bite. Get some scoff. Just have lunch. Yeah, I'm just gonna go and have lunch now. We've got more firing up. Yeah, I can hear them still running. I don't know if they're hot hitting or not. I never got to hear it. There was this frequency that was taking up all the channel. You know, suddenly someone was speaking and it was on interference. Couldn't hear anything. Right. So, uh, don't really know. We'll find out in a bit. They are running. Still definitely running. So I'm just going to grab the bike. In some of those Ted salmon. Yeah, well, that's some salmon. <laughs> I 
Yeah, it should do off as well. Just oh, charge no, in the back So not the day, Colin's done. Yeah. Uh, uh, Waddington, sorry. See, see how it works. See, yeah, I'm I sure I've just I've just seen on the group, so I'm put on the Colin group that the uh, Hornets, uh, something's have turned up, or maybe it's some support vehicles. Yeah. Right. But uh, the Hornets didn't turn up. Yeah. 
Yeah. You could have sat there looking at some landing lights for hours. Missed all of this. Mm. So you played it all smart. Smart yeah. move to do. Come here, you, there were engines running, but there was planes taking off. You might as well start this, and then luckily. There was a bit of a mix up with local time, their time, our time. Yeah, it was definitely meant that. Local time is local to them. To them. An hour ahead, yeah. Because it was exactly an hour late. Exactly. exactly what they said. Yeah. But it doesn't matter if we got there in the end. Didn't yeah. miss one, did we? Yeah, not one. You kind of did. Yeah, quite a bit. It's had made a call at Tom to pay when we got back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were like that when we got back. Come on, it was come on. We got here. We wait. Get, we you got the base on speed though. Yeah. There's a little <laughs> pour on the pad. I reckon they waited to get, for you to go live. There's something as far went right. He's live. Go on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give him a thumbs up. He's laying down. Yeah, yeah. Uh, That's brilliant. My mate Steve from Friday. Um, I introduced him to your channel a little while ago. So yeah. How it all works. But he says seeing you do it compared to when you watch it. It's, it's mad, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. And the way you move the bear and, and get well, it all going. We were just watching, from, we were just, Ollie was laughing, he said, look, he's got, he's got one team, and he's Reggie. <laughs> it is, it's awesome, isn't it? What's mad is when until you actually get here and see Ted, it looks about that big on the <laughs> telly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then when you actually turn it off. It's good when you're washing past the viewfinder. <laughs> yeah. Brilliant. I love Step some some of his moves are quality. Yeah, he's he awesome. Yeah, he's cobra. I like his it's cobra. Definitely, it's definitely I think my favourite for actual just manic is the old Walker Walker. Oh yeah, that, <laughs> oh, that is good. Yeah, yeah, that is a good one. But that's always guaranteed to lose a bear rate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we took it too early, but he's always got this Christmas outfit as well. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the Christmas outfit. Yeah. 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 Last year when you were here. Yeah, we did a whole month of wearing his Santa. I was saying how lovely it is though, because people come and ask pictures of their kiddies. Yeah. If, yeah. if, that, if that gets a little kiddie interested, if the bear gets the kiddie interested in aviation, job done. That's brilliant. Well, you had someone from Texas, didn't you? Were they seven hours behind? Yeah. It's incredible. Yeah. Australia, they're yeah, all Australia. into. Australia. <laughs> I keep saying that, you're going to go up and run. Time, they're going to give you a call, so yeah. they're going to get you in it. Or at least, or at least, have to film you do. At least yeah. a fast, at least a fast taxi. No, yeah, yeah. That yeah. Be awesome. you'll get a experience of some sort. I don't know. You never know. Even if he's at Conesby, one of the guys. Will get Ted it. can't keep getting the glory. Come on, <laughs> the man behind. He got a taxi back from Rio, didn't he? He got Ted? a taxi too, and, and yeah. a taxi oh, Conesby. Oh, so he went yeah. on your own with Claire Bear, and he was. And not only that, he Fly flew in the Chinook display as well. Why yes. not throw that yeah, in? Yeah, you are. Sunday. Have to be and then over yesterday it. at East Kirk Village, they put him in the T6 40 minutes. Flew him for about 40 minutes. His logbook's chocking, eh? Yeah, I need to update it. He's got some good flying out, hasn't he? Yeah, his logbook's chocking. He went over the whole week as well yesterday, over the tower as well. I didn't know. But I could see it on the ADSB tracker. Wow. That was funny. I was like, Ted, you're going to whole week. I'm going to have to have a breakfast, but he's having something so, right, isn't he? Yeah, and then, um, what else? And then they, they put him in the mosquito for a taxi. Like, oh, 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 yeah. there it is. Now. Especially when they, when they were attacking and then he finished and he's waving yeah, out the window. Yeah, he's waving out the window. don't drop him. I know, I saw the, I saw <laughs> the propeller. I was like, oh my gosh. Please don't. There's your teddy bear. That would have ended the live stream. That would have ended the live stream. Can you imagine that? Oh, Kids would have been destroyed. Animals. I would have been destroyed. I would have gone by about the kids. Yeah. Oh my goodness, mate. <laughs> oh, no, it's right, how are we doing then? What's going on with the ground? Are they gone? So they've gone and the chocks are still there. And, so, and, the, and the extinguishers are still up. But like, they, they did do this Friday. Because I messaged you and said that the chocks were still, were still out. Whether, whether they clear that in first and then mm. come up and clear this in. Yes, have a look. Ah, oh, oh, ladies, gents, and teddy bears, how are we doing? Yeah. It's got a little bit, a bit nasty, the weather. It's not that great. It's, uh, things uh, are on its way, I think, to Bournemouth. But how are we doing? I've had to put, a, had to put this on. How are you doing? Hope you're well. I hope you've enjoyed that today. We're just going to stay put until about four o'clock, perhaps, or maybe half four, just to see how it goes, because you never know. There could be some movement. The chocks are still out. The fire extinguishers are still out. It's possible. You just never know. So we're just going to hang around for a little bit and see how it goes, because I don't want you to miss anything, especially after today with all the action. But I will be getting home at some point to pack ready for Bournemouth Air Festival, which is going to be wet. 
that's been sort of like the theme for the year. But anyway, how are we doing? How, are you enjoying the show? You all good? We'll do, um, anyone ask Ted any questions? Let's just get Ted on. Ted, do a quick Q&A. Why not? Let's have a look, Ted. That's our squadron leader, Ted Coningsby. How are we all doing, ladies, gents, and teddy bears? Hope we're all good. Here he is. If anyone has any questions to Ted while he's here, I'll be waiting for our next movement and feel free. But uh, has Ted got weather gear? He has, yes he has, he has got waterproofs. He has indeed. Ted's saying two. Ted's about two years old in Bear World. How good was it to ride in the Mosquito? It was that good, Ted, was it? That was a brilliant day. And yeah, someone just mentioned saying they, um, mentioning about the stream from yesterday. It was absolutely fantastic. It was such a good buzz. Um, we had a great day at Lake Eve today. Uh, my boy got a photo of you, Nikos. He's now hooked on watching planes, now heading back home to pool ready from Bournemouth Air Festival. Have a great day. Rod, thank you so much for coming to say hello. And our, our good friend down below there, uh, Richard said that if Ted can influence and give the enthusiasm to one child, to aeroplanes and to aircraft, then that's one extra that could be influenced to joining our Air Force. So that was very well said from Richard there. Thank you very much, Richard. Uh, hey Ted, do you ever get troubled by security? <laughs> I guess that's a no. Has Ted got a girlfriend? Uh, he does, yeah. A little, um, a bear friend, yes. Her name's Gina. She uh, usually gets gets on the show quite rarely, about twice a year. She has popped on the show. It is. Well done, Tress Fire. That is exactly why the beret comes off. It is in honour and recognition of Margaret Halton. Very good. That was brilliant. Is Wingy a relative of Ted's? Uh, LEJ approach. Good question. I think all teddy bears are related in some way or other, but as in direct, direct, uh, as in family member. I, I don't think. I don't think so. But all bears are related in some form or way. He does, Shelley. He does get to fly pretty much in everything. His next hopeful flight will be in an F-35 with the Valkyries. Christine Barnes, what jet are you looking forward to seeing at Bournemouth the most? Typhoon, of course, Ted. And that was it to one. And then it went mental. I think it was 25, 26. Yeah. We'll be right back wherever that went. It's getting offended. We lost. Yes. Oh no. Uh, I heard it. There it is. The bear is gone. <laughs> there it is. Bear right there. Bear right there. Oh my goodness me, how did it do that? Ted. Well, the ammo. It's going to look like a ball of marines one at this rate. Thanks a lot, man. On the tank? Oh, I haven't seen that. I'll tell you what. Would you guys come down for me? I'm in Murex, which is not too bad. We went to Cabot for the weekend for the Super Bowl, so we stayed up in the extra bike. Super Bike's good? Yeah, it was good. Yeah. 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 Friday was the worst. Uh, yeah. Dr. Soda, would Ted skydive with the Falcons? You're only good. Yes, you'd do that, would you? My goodness, be brave, Ted. I live in Hertfordshire, so 
Oh, yeah, the weather looks tragic. Oh dear. Uh, Chris blocks them. Can... Why not? Definitely, why not? We can do that. Uh, hang on a minute. Who was it that mentioned the walker? Richard, for your good work today, we will do the walker for you. Blade slap coming up. Ready, Ted? <laughs> it needed the blade slap noise, but that was for you, man, for today. <laughs> that was. Uh, <laughs> it goes well with the blade slap. If you watch any of our walk-up videos, it's just, oh, that was brilliant. That was good. Half to one entertainment. I'll tell you what. Um, let's have a look. Who else? Let's have a look. I might even get Reggie on there. Like that is exactly right. Take that. <laughs> yeah. Should we do a Q&A yeah. with Reggie for a laugh? Oh, that's going to be hilarious. Go on, Reggie, put your berry on, mate. Eee, you are right there now. What's all this? You interrogation me now. You got to go interrogate me now, there now. Go for it there. Anyone got any questions there now? Oh, and I'll do a little bit of PR for the channel there now. Keep it quick there now. Make it sweet and neat there now. Let me know what you got there. Arr. You got any questions? You gotta let me know. Make it quick. I ain't got all day there no. Stu Martin says, Reggie, are you from Jamaica? No, I don't think so, there no. What makes you think I'm from Jamaica there no? <laughs> this is this is gonna be hilarious, this one, isn't it? What do you mean there no? Reggie, you're on the spot, and they're all asking you any question that they want. Is uh, what is Reggie's favourite singer or band? Oh, I like Oasis. They're no, they're good. They're no, Oasis. Yeah, are they're no. I like that one. They're no, it's good. They're no. Doncaster Lass, Reggie, are you related to Captain Jack Sparrow? Oh yeah, me and my Jack Sparrow there now. We go back a long way there now. You know what I mean there now? It's all good there now. <laughs> Steve Martin, uh, people are asking where your accent is from, uh, Reggie. I don't understand what you mean there now. I like to keep it sweet and neat round here and confuse the enemy with my mixed accent there now. That's why I do it there. You see, if people go, oh yeah, it's that fella from that place or that place there now. But if you don't know my accent where it's actually from, you change it, confuse the enemy there now. That's how we do it there now. We Reggies. We, you can tell Reggie, we've all got a mush. Look, the longer the mush, the more sensitive to trouble. We, we fight trouble with trouble, you see there now. We look out for things. We keep things safe on the ground there now, so the planes can land there now, and, and aircraft and helicopters there now. What is Reggie's favourite meal? Oh, I do like a burger and chips there now. Burger and chips and tin food. I like that there now. It's all good there now. <laughs> It's all good there now. All is good there now. A lot of people get a bit excited around. What's this? It's a fly. I've got to get it. Come on in. I'm going to get this fly. I've got to get this fly. I'm going to get me chopsticks. You see that Reggie in action. That's right. RAF Regiment, for those who don't know me. Part of the RAF Regiment. That's right. No one messes with us. He might be flying up there in the sky there now. And I'll take care of things on the ground there now. Um. <laughs> 
I'm gonna get this fly. This fly's annoying me there now. Gotta get this fly. I'm gonna use the lunge on it there now. Um, ladies, gents, and teddy bears, a first for the Ted Coningsby channel, fly catching. All right there, Reggie, what is going on around here? What is all this fuss going on? I'm over there by the old uh, ASP. It looked like you were having some sort of fit. Well, I'm all good there now, all that ground crew crew. Well, it looked like you were having some sort of fit. I didn't know you were chasing a fly. I did no one messes with me. Oh, the fly's irritating me there now. Yeah, I know, mate, but you could just spray some fly spray or something. It'll just walk away. Well, I didn't think of that there now, and I didn't ask for your advice there now, did I? Yeah, I know, mate. Calm down. Calm down. You're right there, pal. You want a bit of a hug? Oh, that's good there, mate. Right, listen. As long as you're right, it's all good. Okay? If you need anything, we're over there by the hangars. Well, that's fine there now. It's very good there now. Thanks for letting me know there now. Yeah, no worries. You're right. You have a good day. Mine ain't good. Do you want some uh, flying saucers? I've never tried sweets there now. I'm more of a savoury person there now. Well, that's not bad. That's, that's probably why you've got good teeth. Pretty good. Well, mine ain't good. I just thought you were having a fit. No, I'm all good there now. Chasing a fly there now. That's right. I don't want any flies around me there now. Well, all right, mate. If you need any fly spray, I'll go and get you some. All right, one sec. Well, I don't want any fly spray. He's gone there now. Oh, those ground crew. Confusing me with... <laughs> Cut! <laughs> Cut! <laughs> By the way, I just want to let everyone know, this is not rehearsed, just like whatever, whatever, just goes and just do it. It's and just it's all professionals, mate. <laughs> oh, dear. Fantastic. You do that in the winter for blips of the week. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're fun doing that. Why are we doing... Oh, gosh, it's nearly four o'clock already. Run. I pick them up on the way out, yeah. Way goes quiet. Yeah. Marco, thank you for the Red Ted appreciation oh, super yeah, chat. Been getting a guards march from Red, from Red Ted. Thanks a lot, Marco. So yeah, it's just sounding a bit quiet. We're going to wait till. It Pretty much 1600 local. If it doesn't sound like anything's gonna happen, actually, that fly is annoying. Um, I totally agree with <laughs> Reggie there. Yeah, what's this? What's it's just landing on everything. How are you doing lately? Are you good? What's going on around here? Where's Reggie gone? He had a bit of a moment. Now there's a cow replaced. Unbelievable. I think Reggie was having a moment then. It was it's all good. How you doing, darling? Alright, nice set of horns there. Oh god, they're a bit sharp! True. I, I don't think you should be messing around with Highland cows. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm intrigued. I didn't know, Nikos, right, that Highland cows 
have horns for both male and female. It's pretty impressive, isn't it? Well, I'm done for the day, Nick. I'm about to go, mate. So I'm locking up and shutting shop. I'm off. I've got a little track down to Thetford now. So what, on your BMX? Yeah, 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 it's fine. Goes with the wind, you know. It's a BM. They used the BMX I've got in the Olympics, you know. That's why I've got a GT, I know. I've got a BM. That's right, a BMX. What's that? Really? No way, that's amazing. Well, listen, I'm going to lock up now, I'll, I'll see you soon. All right, mine, there you go. And what did Lakey say to Drew? Find out next week. Yeah, are you done, dude? Yeah, I'm going to make a move. Yeah, thank you very much for today. That's Pleasure, much appreciate mate. it, thank you. You're welcome. You take care, see you soon. Yeah, you too, man. Have I think I'm going to shut up, yeah. shut shop yeah. as well now. I think see I'm done for the day. Done, yeah. I think so. Right, I'll just wrap it up, I think. I don't think so. Da -da 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 -da. Ladies, gents, and teddy bears. Tell you what, it's been an absolute pleasure. And um, it's been brilliant. The, we the weather's starting to deteriorate a bit. So it could be just as well that we're heading off. Um, but yeah, what a day. Another 1K stream, apart from today's little mini stream. But it's been a fantastic day. And I'm glad you've all enjoyed it. New subscribers, thank you so much for joining in the fun as the fun channel that we are. It's been fantastic. And uh, yeah, brilliant stuff. So thank you to the 48 Fighter Wing. Thank you like is from everywhere from the ground to the skies thank you so much and and all of you at tower as well and just literally every single job role here at 48 fight when we are proud of what you know we are proud of having you here we are proud of what you do so thank you so much and you you know on the flying side of things you bring so much joy you inspire so many kids here you know it's amazing you, you do you really do inspire and you know what don't don't always think that the flying just inspires young pilots because that you know they you know so i can see some children have actually said that they want to like be a ground crew and that i heard that the other day and i was like wow that's that's brilliant and i just hope i wonder if we take any influence of that with our little characters and the bears so thank you very much listen everyone have a good one we will be back soon next week for Coningsby and Lake and Eve and all the other bases that are local to us uh, but we are now heading to Bournemouth Fair Festival. Ladies, gents, teddy bears, my name's Nick Oss, this is squadron leader Ted Coningsby and it's been an absolute pleasure. Take care, see you soon, wish you well. Go, go.